Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Animal Crossing City Folk. Day number... I've already lost count. 30 or something. Ah, came to play, huh? Right now, we have fall. September 12th. Yes, let's get started. Yeah. Hang on, who am I? I'm King, again. Sure, coming to go in a lot today, huh, King? Yeah, so... I logged in very briefly today. Well, it was supposed to be brief. It took a lot longer than I was expecting it to. I just wanted to go find the money rock, the fossils, and more importantly, the gyroids. Mm, those gyroids. So I popped in and just ran around looking for those. Uh, that last gyroid. So three fossils, three gyroids. That last gyroid whew, it took me a really, really long time, and it was just in like an obvious spot that I ran over like six times without seeing the uh, the splats that I could dig up on the ground. But I found them. I don't even know like what they are. So we're gonna put them in the house. I haven't even done that. And we're gonna go identify the fossils. We're gonna go see what Nook has for sale. We're gonna go see what the Able Sisters have for sale. And we're gonna go into town. That's, that's what we're doing today. So what do we got? Mini Drilloid. What do you do? It's Oh, that's... That's kind of obnoxious. It's okay. If it were any higher pitch than that, that would be real obnoxious. Okay, uh, we got a Mega Bovoid. Okay, this is a little weird, but, you know, gyroids, that's what they do. Mini alloid, what do you do? Ooh, you're also completely in the wrong spot. I wanted to put you down there. Yeah, on Saturday we're going to get some music. Hopefully some good music that we can play in here. And maybe get these guys lined up on a bit more of a beat. All right, we'll turn that one off. The uh, the ding dong, the uh, mini alloy is not bad. Okay, we can have four go on at a time. That's not bad. Five? Can we have all six? I know there's a limit to how many we can have going, but... Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. Alright. Okay, yep. Super happy with that. I am quite pleased. We did not get any mail today, so no responses from the two letters we sent yesterday. Uh, oh, I haven't checked to see if there are any new neighbors. Violet, Bob, Winnie, Lucy, Static, Curly, Spork, Agent S, and Becky. Okay. Nope, that's it. Um, Tom Nook, let's go see what he has for sale. Oh, fossils also. Let's do the fossils first, get those out of my inventory. And if we get another Stego torso, we could sell it. Who knows? It could happen. Hello Blathers, no terrible bugs. Only super cool dinosaur fossils today. Check fossil. Oh, come on. There we go. And it is... In a large ancient nutshell, this is an apato tail. Cool. Starting in on the Apatosaurus. Yes, please take. I'm chuffed as chips. Me too. Yep, we have... Oh, come on. Waggle controls. And... Oh, a T-Rex tail. Now we're talking. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Oh, 
Oh man, I want more of a T-Rex too. Oh my gosh. That would be so exciting. Ankylo skull. Oh cool, the second part of the Ankylosaurus. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. Three new fossils. That feels really good. Almost nothing on display. It's all right. I'm, uh, I'm working on it. I'm trying to help you out, buddy. Oh, there's a Tricera skull. That's pretty cool. That's the Stego torso. You can see the uh, big old plates on its back. Uh... Yeah, here's the Ankylosaurus. Look at that. There's the skull and there's the tail. The big old, like, bony knot at the end there. The club. What is this? The Iguanodon. Look at you. The T Rex tail. Oh, so it's like only maybe two parts? It's maybe just a two parter? It's not as wide as some of the other ones. We have our Archaeopteryx around here somewhere, too. It's probably going to be in the back room. I think the back room is where... Ooh, is that our... Oh, that's our saber-toothed uh, tiger torso. Down there. Yeah, okay, so the Archaeopteryx fossil is just a, a single unit like that. So there's a whole bunch of those that we're going to get. Something's going to go there. That's going to be neat. Same with the tiger. Um, I think these spots are going to be like flying ones, like a pterodactyl or something that will be hanging from the ceiling. That'll be cool. That'll be so cool. I love dinosaurs. Okay. Whew. All right. We'll have to leave the dinosaurs for now. We'll be back. We'll be back and hopefully we'll be fleshing out. Well, boning out, I guess? I don't know. Does that seem mm, maybe not the best use of words? Maybe, maybe not a good phrase. Uh, we'll be putting more stuff in there sooner or later. All right, Nook, what do you got for sale today? Do you have a slingshot, or do we have to? I think we have to wait until we get an upgrade before we can get a slingshot. One item on special today. You don't say. What is that? Oh, is it the treasure chest? <gasps> okay, let's. Uh, Fair good king, give a good eye, hmm? That's today's special. Yes, yes, a treasure chest. 8,600 bells. Don't miss out on it. I kind of do want it. Yar, I'm a pirate. I'll take it. Oh, it hurts. But it's also so cool. I did find the money rock. I think I mentioned that already. Plank flooring. Is this for when someone has to walk the plank? Uh, it's... I, like, it's not bad. It's just, a. Uh... Dirt Cloud Wall again. Okay, no. Still, no. No, thank you. <sighs> Alright, well. We did it. We bought a treasure chest. Okay, now we gotta run all the way. Oh, another thing. Real quick. Easily Distracted. Welcome to my Let's Play of the Easily Distracted game. Starring me. I'm easily distracted. Uh, when there's a bird chirping on this, that means there's a new message. So... Ah, Nook special. We got a very special item in today. Yes, it's a treasure chest. Come check it out. Nook's cranny. Cool. It's gone. I am your new king. Swear fealty to me or perish. <laughs> yep, that's still a pretty good advertisement for Nook's cranny. Um, a bridge here. We're going to go visit the Able Sisters and see if they have any cool accessories, any cool fashion. Hello, Bob. Hey, you changed your dress. Are you out for a walk, too? Yes, I am. What you think, King? Does this net make me look like I don't know what I'm doing? Well, if you ever wanted to take a picture, now's the time. Nah. Sorry, Bob. I'm not really in a picture-taking mood. Was there... Oh, it was... You. Hanging out down here. Okay. <clears throat> um... Table Sisters. Oh, there's Becky. You're out and about today. 
to see glad to see you're gracing us with your fine presence, Chicklet. Well, I'm glad that you know how to speak to your king. I've learned all sorts of interesting things since I began seriously studying gardening. Planting similar kinds of flowers together will produce more of that variety. Ooh. And that increase can lead to other things such as changing the patterns of color. Once you know that, you never look at gardens the same way again. What? I... Oh, hello. Who are you? Wendell! So hungry. Must eat something. Stomach's so very empty. Keeps making noise like blurgle, blurgle. Can't take it anymore. I'll eat anything. Just give me something. You're going to have to tough it out, buddy. We're going to have to give you a fruit or something, maybe? I don't know. Do we give him a fruit? Here, have a peach. They're literally on trees all around you. There are lots of them. Because I've hardly shaken any of them out of trees. Here, have a, have a peach. This is unexpected. We have a visitor. Wendell. What, uh, what do you, what, how do you feel about peaches? Do you want to, like, do you want to eat a fish? What's going on? Ooh, th thank you. Good food. You must eat it right away. Thank you. Oh, so good. So tasty. So satisfactory. As thanks, must give you one of my designs, but you have to erase one of your current ones first. Oh, he gives us the designs. Yes. We have just whatever the defaults are. I have not touched those at all. These are... Terrible. It's a pattern so that you can equip, like you can equip this as a hat, and you can see how like the colors and, and stuff line up, so you kn you have like a a basis for creating your own things. I don't care. I'm so glad I found someone good to take coloring rover. So, so happy, so satisfactory. Well, I'm happy to have fed you. People around here are so nice. I'll come here again when I get hungry. Uh, uh, I don't know about that. Nope, where is... There we go. Oh. Neat. We have that now. We could, like, put that on a hat or umbrella or t-shirt or something. Um, this, 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 like, front row of stuff that doesn't change- Hey, look at that! It's the, uh, pink zap suit. It's back. Um, this front row of stuff that doesn't change. I think these are all patterns also. That we could take and replace our own patterns. Ooh, look at this! A superhero mask. <gasps> uh, I look also kind of burglary. Don't you think? Um, I'm gonna say no to that. A danger shirt. No, that's okay. Uh, I do really want another pink zap suit though. Nope, that's still the danger shirt. Nope, pink zap suit. I wanted this and we traded it away and I want it back. I'll take it. I like the zap suits. Okay. We've spent more money than I had intended to. We've also spent a lot more time than I realized we were going to spend here in town. That's okay. We are going to go to the city. It is city time. Yay, look at that. I made it back here on my first try. Didn't get lost. Bus to the city. Want to take the bus? Yes, please. Let's go check out the city. <gasps> I'm so excited. We really are out in the boonies, aren't we? If we got to take a bus to get into the city. Oh, we have a flag, by the way. That tree in the background there. We can just we can change that flag. I believe. I might do that. I do want to change the song. I don't know what I want to change it to though. Oh, it's Captain. Well, he's got like a little bobblehead Captain in a boat on his dashboard right there. Well, ahoy there, matey. You got a familiar face. Yar, ain't you the lad that moved to town some time ago? So I takes it this be your maiden voyage to the city. It actually is, yes. Yar. Yar, her, har. Oh, I knew it. You're like a fresh minnow wiggling into the net of the city for the first time. Anyone can tell just by peeping at your fancy duds. You're looking to dazzle folk with your swigger swagger. I am, actually. So I got my blue zap suit. Oh, the tale's been told a thousand times the same. A proud country boy thinks he can tame the city. I've seen that type before, you wee grouper. 
And if you carry an attitude like that, the city will gobble ye up. Oh, yar, don't think it hasn't happened before. And to bigger fish than ye. Ah, city ho! You wanted to look the city in the eye. You got it. It looms ahead and awaits your grand entrance. Can I turn and look? I want to look at the city. I want to see the city. I want to look at the city. I want to look out the window. I'll look, the city's right over there. I want to go look at it. Ah. Now off ye go, ye young snapper. Don't ye go disappointing me now. Come back, a big fish. We didn't, we didn't, we didn't get to see the city. I mean, we'll see it now because we're here. Ooh, this is neat. Look at all the animals just stomping around. There's like a penguin. There's a, like a really sad looking duck. There's a doggo. I pet the dog. And is that Winnie? Is Winnie from our town here? Goldie! I love checking out the latest model room. Well, technically, I love stealing the latest decorating tips. I don't think that's Winnie. I think it's a different horse. Friga! Whew, I'm tired of all this walking. As soon as I get back to town, I'm having a nice coffee at Brewster's Cafe. Brumf. So, Shampoodle, we can go get him a haircut. Uh, I don't know what that is. What's, uh, what's Skunky Boy doing here? Kicks! All right there, young sir. Fancy a shoe shine. There's 500 bells, and you'll see your reflection in them. Uh, no. No thanks. All right, suit yourself. You just swing on by when your shoes need a spit and a shine. Uh, I think this is the... Happy Room Academy, or whatever it's called. Yeah, you're a different horse. Glide! Where the heck are all the restaurants around here? But no restaurants means no shaved ice. Uh, Butch, say, you know that salon, Shampoodles, right? Would it be, um, weird if I went there? Rof! I, um, I mean, obviously, I look perfect as I am, but I've been thinking about the future, and, um, aging. Pate. Oh, turnips. I want to have my hair done, but I just had it done the other day, and I'm totally broke. Maybe I'll just go watch other people get their hair done. Quackle. Oh, the animals are great. Puppet show? A movie? What's going on here? That's the uh, ATM. This is a super sketchy alleyway. Oh, there, friend. Old Red doesn't recognize you. I don't think you're one of our members, right? Our top priority here is trust. That's why we are members only. Of course, if someone referred you... That's a different story. You got an invitation? I do not. Once we get invited, we'll be able to go in there and maybe buy art. Really, really, really expensive art. Uh, this is the Happy Room Academy, isn't it? This is the, uh, this is like where they have the models. Yeah. Lyle. Hey, you, wait. Listen. Hold it. Stop. Just stop. Oh, well, Lyle needs to talk at you for a second. Me? I'm Lyle. This place? Mine. Name? The Happy Room Academy. But enough about me. Let's talk about you. Your name? King. Bang. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, Lyle got you, didn't he? Listen, you? Homeowner, right? Place in Leofall. Picket fence. Wife and kids living the dream. Lyle used to have dreams. Lyle used to have it all. Big car, corner office, bang. Then it all went to pot. Oh, poor Lyle. We're hearing a sad life story. I didn't know what the boss said. Offices are for closers. Oh no, poor Lyle. That's what you get for being in sales. It's, uh, it's a tough life, you know? Guy busted my chops! You believe it? Yeah, but enough, right? Right. My problems? Mine. Not yours. Let's talk. Letter. Mine. You got it? Uh... You're scaring me. Hey, wait, hold it! Me? Scare ya? Haha! <laughs> you're having some fun with Lyle! I'm a peach! No joke. Bang. The letter? Not a problem. No worries. None. Maybe one. Never mind. The deal? Here it is. Houses are work, right? Sure! Get furniture. Set it here. Set it there. Move it around. Worry some more. If it don't look good, you don't feel good. How do you know when it's right? Instinct? Luck? Bang? And that's where I come in. Did I say me? I meant we. Us. This place. The Happy Room Academy. We'll show you how to make rooms. Good rooms. Rooms you can be proud of. Happy rooms. Here's the deal. This academy? Exclusive. Members only. Very chick. All that. But you? Good people. We like you. You should join. Come on. Join the Happy Room Academy. Sure. They're gonna raid our house terribly because it's tiny and just has whatever random nonsense in there. It's filled with with fungus. Moldy fungus that we dug out of the ground. Good choice. Excellent. Glad to hear it. See a bull? Take the horns, am I right? Bang! Ha 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 Okay, here's the deal. 
We're gonna be checking out your room, looking at colors and furniture and whatnot. When we're done, we'll give you a report. Tells you how to snazz up the joint. Not home, out, about, doesn't matter. We let ourselves in, that's kind of creepy. We got keys, that's super creepy. Lots of them, thousands. Yeah, that's, that is sketchy. I see your face, you're worried. Don't be, this academy, legit. Above board, totally legit. Oh wait, there's more, themes. We got themes, new ones, each month, decided by me. Right here in the back, there's a model room. Shows the theme, gives you ideas, all that. Your room, could be there. Could be the model room. If we like it, we'll pick it. Easy, right? Right, bang. What's that, me? You wanna know about me? No, I don't. I don't wanna know about you. We already heard your weird life story about losing your office and I, I, don't, I don't want more of that. You ain't gonna bust my chops or nothing, right? Yeah, well, okay, sure. Meet and greet, why not? Me, Lyle, chairman of the Happy Room Academy. This wasn't always my job. I used to be somebody. Big shot, important. But stuff happens, yeah? I mean, this seems pretty important. You're the chairman of the Happy Room Academy. <laughs> yeah, enough about old Lyle. Welcome aboard, King. You, me, us, together. Thrilled. What a weird little otter. Oh, Animal Crossing. You have such delightful characters. Hey, this is... This, this looks very familiar. I think we've seen this exact room. See how this guy's keeping the beat here? This, uh, gyroid? Can we turn the music off? Surf and KK, we cannot turn it off. Rock guitar and a metal guitar. Yeah, we have a we have a very zappy, staticky friend who has a room that is exactly that. So lucky him. He was he he got chosen as the theme. That's cool. All right, we're gonna pop into Gracie Grace. This is uh this is the shop where everything is clearly way too expensive for us, but we're gonna pop in here and just take a look. Oh, LaBelle, are you another one of the the Abel Mabel Sable sisters? Welcome to Gracie Grace where we specialize in wearable art and hot couture for the home. <gasps> Is that a witch's hat? <gasps> oh, it'd be really fun to coordinate that item with the right outfit, don't you think? Can I try it on? Wow, that looks amazing on you. Who needs diamonds when you have a good hat? I agree. 4,800 bells compared to the like 400 bells that stuff costs back in town. Uh, uh, a witch shirt, really? There's, you got the whole witch outfit right here? Ooh, that's so expensive! 7,200 bells! Holy moly, that's so expensive! Gaston! What, what, are, what are you doing here? Don't you have like eggs to be eating and songs to be singing? Can anyone around here actually afford this stuff, Bon Chow? No. No, they cannot. So we got some shirts here. I could be wearing like a computer chip. What is this? That display highlights some of our premier coordinates. Okay. Oh, good eye. Nothing spices up an ensemble like a retro helmet. Can I try it on? Wow, it looks amazing on you. Who needs diamonds when you got a good hat? Uh, no, it's not me. Oh, yes, of course. I completely understand. Look at this. Wouldn't this be a cool room to have? Themed with all of the, the candies and goodies, and I would just be hungry constantly. Um, yeah, if you want to see just how expensive all this stuff is. This little treasure is a sweet snap. You can coordinate it with matching carpet and wallpaper to really tie a room together. How much is it? Oh! It's like more expensive than our house. No. Uh oh, we got stuck. There we go. Uh, this is the wallpaper and carpet that we see in here. So this is cool. We'll probably pop back in here and check out stuff. I, I'm super tempted to become a witch. We could spend all of our money on becoming a witch. It is September. Halloween is right around the corner. Mm -hmm. 
It is but a small price to play for quality. Quality witchiness. We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. It's so expensive, but we'll do it. Ah, it hurts. I was going to go get a haircut, but I think being a witch is just as good, if not better. All right, so what's this? We're not going to do the movie theater thing. Lloyd! Mm, yes, welcome to the auction house, my good man. Shame and heartache, but we're currently preparing to accept bids. The next bidding period will last for two days and begin on September 14th. Oh. That's, what, like two days or something? We will have to come back. And we'll have to have money when we come back. That's, that seems really important. Ooh, another doggo. Hello. Cookie. Eek. I like, I have to get my fortune told. I wonder if I have enough money. Surely it'll reveal something about my... Art? Love? Love life? I don't know. Tee hee hee hee. I can't wait. Orphan? Okay. How expensive is a haircut? And does it matter because we, we're going to be wearing a witch's hat for the rest of our life? Harriet's. Hi there, sugar. This is your first time here, is it? Goodness, don't need to look like a deer cut in the headlights. I promise not to bite. Welcome to Shampoodle, where we help you express your inner beauty on the outside. I love it. Would you like to change your hairstyle today? Or maybe you're in the mood for a total makeover. Sure thing. Just leave it to me, sweetie. It'll be a piece of cake. Let's see for the shampoo. Nope. Oh. You look fabulous just the way you are. Well, thank you. I will... I, I shouldn't have got the witch's outfit, should I? We have the zap suits, and now... Oh. Okay. And we still have the 3D glasses. Nice. So we can have our fortune told. I don't know what this does for us, though. Katrina. Yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna read all that. Welcome, lost one of the Pisces sign, traveler of many winding roads. I can unravel the threads of destiny that surround you, coax the happiness within you to bloom. I, Katrina, will foresee your future, or reveal the charm that lies hidden for just 100 bells. What charm? Fortune? We'll do fortune today. Sure. Very well. Let me bring your star matrix into view. That seems like not a good fortune. Ah, uh, yes, I'm starting to see it. I see two little stars facing off with only the power of their tiny starlight beams. They stand growing in recognition of each other and growing to blinding levels of brightness. At this rate, they will one day be envied by even the biggest stars. The stars surrounding you shine down with a soothing, gentle light. As they shine upon you, they illuminate a gentleness and universal appeal. During the shining time, you will garner support especially from those who share your gender. Just remember that the way you see the world may have little to do with how the world sees you. That is all. What, is, what does that mean? Remember that bad times are just times that are bad. Okay. I, I don't feel particularly reassured over any of that. No haircut. Oh, hello, camouflage frog. Camo frog. Okay. Yeah, that's literally what your name is. Got it. I'm always amazed at how many bells people just toss for that fountain. Yeah, it's probably bad luck to fish them all out, though. Damn it. Filberts. Where the heck are all the restaurants? Yeah, we... Oh, no peanut brittle. Okay. Nan. I'm checking out the latest model room. Yep. So they're... It's different animals, but they're saying the same things. Pom pom. It's autumn already, and that means it's time to shine up my summer sandals. Barbara. Oh, I love it. This weather's so nice. It's a perfect day for me to stretch my legs and come here, darling. Okay. That was our first visit to the big city. We, uh... We spent way more money than we should have on becoming a witch. I guess we're gonna go home. 
honestly, we could probably call it quits there. I really don't want these videos to go on for too terribly long, but there's so much stuff I want to do. I want to go fishing, I want to go catch bugs. I want to go shake peaches out of trees and sell them. I want to go get stung in the face when I fail to catch a bee. So, add your fortunes fair in our... In the city is what I mean. You feeling like you'll be the talk of the town right soon? Let me tell you, my, my wee scallywag. From here, you don't even look like the talk of the bus. I think I'm the only person on the bus, too. Nar, but don't fret on it. Even if you didn't exactly distinguish yourself. No one gets it right the first time. And besides, there's always... There'll always be a grin to be found at home. And we ain't too far from Leaf Hall. Get some proper grub in ye when ye get home, yar. Man's got to rely on his strength, ye hear me? I am no simple man. I am a witch now. I am a 3D witch. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. Alright, I feel obligated to do, like, a tiny little bit of something else. So let's maybe go talk to a friend and let's go try to catch a fish. Then we can call it quits. Got the gyroids, got the fossils. We can also, like, go bug, bug catching, but we've already got most of those. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll talk to Violet. Hello, King! I hope you're doing well. Catching bugs and getting compliments are so similar. Really? If one starts to get away from you, you really can't chase after it. And if one comes straight for you, it's probably trouble. But when one floats by, you just want to get in its path, as if you were meant to be together. No, I don't... I don't, I don't think any of that works. By the way, I plan to use this strategy today with a uh, walker cicada. Right, because you took Bob's catchphrase too. Alright, there's a super tiny fish. Let's see if we can catch it. Fishing in this game is not as terrible as it is in some of the games. Oh, jeez, I almost didn't get that. Oh, nice, a goldfish! There's gold in the fish. Not really. It's just a little AB little goldfish. I know that fish change depending on, like, the weather, whether it's raining. I know they change depending on time of day, uh, seasons, bugs, same sort of thing. Sweet fish. Delish. Nice. Sweet. Um, I think we said hi to Becky already today. Should we go catch an ocean fish? The uh, ocean and freshwater fish are also different. Hello. Hello, Winnie. How are you doing? Oh, you know what? I haven't talked to Agent S. H&S, your sidekick is here to visit you. Hello? Oh, you have a fish. What is that? That's a big one. No, I'm gonna turn off the TV. KK Cruisin'. I kind of dig it. King, you're just the person I wanted to talk to, sidekick. Oh my gosh, King. Did you realize we're right smack in the middle of a fall plaid shirt craze? But even though I'm a girl on the front lines of fashion, I can't find one anywhere! You gotta help me, sidekick. If I don't get one, I'll be lame forever. So if you find a fall plaid shirt, can you, like, please bring it to me, sidekick? Yeah, I mean, if I find one. But I'm, we're, A, we're almost done for the day, and B, I have no idea where I would even look for one of those. Because we already went to the Able Sisters, and I don't think they had one. My destiny is like in your little person hand, sidekick. That's a shame. Let's I let's try to catch one more fish. I'd love to get an ocean fish. Just because we have really not done very much fish catching. Also known as fishing. I don't even see any fish. I 
see no fish. Oh, and I do want to buy the flowers. We should probably buy, like, tree saplings, too. Oh, actually, Nook doesn't even sell tree saplings yet. Never mind. I would like to buy some flowers from Tom Nook, though. Okay, well, when I said we were going to do some fishing, I was apparently just being a big old liar. Because there are no fish. They do not exist. They are not real. Aha! I lied yet again. That time, the lie was a ruse, though. I was trying to, to trick the fish into thinking they could come out and be safe. Come on. There we go. Cool. Everybody's favorite. The tire. The tire fish. Classical. Classical fish. Alright, you know what? Fishing's not working out. <laughs> Let's go buy the flowers that Tom Nook has today. We're gonna buy the flowers, and I think we're gonna call it quits for today. We did, we got a lot done. We became a witch. That's not something that you could just do every day, you know. I don't have no idea how often the stuff in the city changes. Like the the Happy Room Academy model room. Uh, I Tom Nook, how do you feel about an old tire? Oh yeah, we bought the treasure chest. We'll keep the zap suits. Yeah, please just get rid of it. He'll just ditch it. Uh, flowers. Please, please, there we go. White tulips! Yes, I'll take it. We gotta really pretty up the town, you know? Lots of flowers. Make it look fantastic. When Tom Nook upgrades, he'll have more stuff for sale every day. It's like more flowers, more like, furniture items, more tool variety. That'd be nice. It'll be a little while, though, before that happens. Um, Spork. You know, King, I think you're pretty cool. Thank you. I think I'm cool, too. I think you're so cool, in fact, that the only way you could be any cooler is if you wore a cape. I agree. I agree. Do you have a cape? Can I get a cape? Do you know where I can find a cape? Oh, he still wants a centipede. We, I didn't get one of those. I, when I ran around looking for the treasure rock, we also had no centipedes show up. I wonder if they only show up at a certain time of day or something. I don't know. We got, like, things to deposit for blathers. I think we'll just do that tomorrow. I think tomorrow... I don't know. We'll probably bounce into town again real quick and just see if anything's changed, if anything's updated. Tomorrow will be Friday. I don't know when, like, weekly resets might happen. Like, if they change their, their inventory weekly, what time, like, what day that would happen? I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go back to our room. Where am I? Oh, I'm destroying flowers. I'm such a bad person. Oh, the other thing we could do. Since we're not wearing them, we don't have, like, a wardrobe or anything. I think we can get those in this game. I have no idea. But let's... Um, place that in the room, and place that in the room. So we got our two superhero zap suits, raring to go. We have all this nonsense happening in here. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. We got a couple of fish to take the blathers. We'll probably do a little more fishing tomorrow. And just take a whole host of fish and fossils into the blathers. I also, you know what, we should, I'll, we'll deal with it tomorrow. I'm just going to, like, deposit our um, watering can here, because we have no need for it. Most of the time we don't need it. It just is eating up one of our precious inventory spaces. Anyway, done for the day. Thanks for watching, everyone. May the grace of the Twilight Dragon be with you.